Hi, this is Rena from thecheesethief.com and I wanted to show you how to use a compass to make these flower patterns. Um, I actually did this, these ones with acrylic paint, but uh, so I took a paintbrush and attached it to the compass. But yeah, I'm just going to show you with a pencil right now because it's easier than dipping the paint. And then, So you're going to start out, um, make a circle with the compass. You want it the size of your paper or any size you want the, the flower. And then you're just going to start at any point around the circle and draw a semicircle this way. And then you're going to take the point of the compass and touch it to where the, the previous line intersects. And then you're just going to keep going like that. And then you're going to go to the next one. I'm going to spin my paper a little just because it makes it easy to draw and then you're going to go to the next one and then you're going to go to the next one so you're just going to end where it, when it intersects again and there you go so that's how you draw a flower to make these patterns with a compass. Now you can get super fancy. I'm going to do smaller ones. Adjust the pencil. And instead of stopping when you go around, you can actually continue the circle and it makes a cooler different pattern. So. Gotta remember which is the center circle. And I'm missing one. So there's another cool flower. And then you can use, if you use, I use acrylic paints for this one, you can use watercolors, but it comes out lighter. Stick a paintbrush on there, dip the paint in, and then draw some circles. This one, I actually made a mistake, and then I made the compass a little smaller. So you go big, and then you do it, and then you make it a little smaller. You can keep swirling around, kind of like a spirograph, until they all connect. That one just happened to connect. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and for more tutorials like this, please visit me at thecheesethief.com. Thank you, and have a great day. Bye.